gonna keep actually I think I might have my son start reading this because it's a comic a comic book I don't even want my son to get into the rat race right I want him to learn to make money on his own not going to clock in a job and get hourly money I don't want him to do that I mean y'all may think differently and that's fine but I don't want my son to do that I want him to learn to create his own legal money so this is escape of the rat race y'all know i've escaped and i'm trying to stay up out of there which is a struggle but i'm i'm working on it every single day uh 199 great home businesses to start <laughs> i read this before i um found out about ebay i used to do amazon too i want to pick it up soon but gotta have money to invest in this stuff raising your child's financial IQ I haven't I don't, I don't know why I put this in there I haven't read this yet my, I want my son to uh, I want to help him with the stuff that I didn't know about money so eventually I'm going to read this and um, share it with him the millionaire next door this is about um it says secrets of america's wealthy this is like about what 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 really wealthy people do like how we think they just go out and buy cars and stuff but the ones that are really wealthy and have lots of money they're really smart about their money um decisions like sometimes i'll go out into the really 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 nice uh areas where they're like mansions and stuff and you'll be surprised they'll have like a 1990 honda accord sitting in the driveway in front of this really really big house you know what i'm saying like not all people are on um wasting money on certain things so but other than that i don't really remember exactly so I, I, I read the books most of the time but I don't remember what they're about because y'all know I have a bad memory I should stop saying that or I'm gonna continue to have a bad memory huh anyway so I've read more books than that but I mostly get books from the library but here are two of my very favorite 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 books right called Moon Game. I bought this for my son because it was my favorite book when I was little. For some reason, I always, when I was little, this moon, I always thought about cheesecake when I saw the moon in the book. <laughs> I think that's why I learned. I mean, that's, excuse me. <laughs> I think that's why I love cheesecake because of this book but it's a really good book and then my second favorite book is Corduroy I love some Corduroy I really 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 love Corduroy I did not know that that little girl was chocolate I mean not that it matters but I didn't realize she was chocolate all this time
lessons unlike these days where they just show our kids a bunch of myths but they actually taught lessons on um you know different things life lessons you know like telling the truth uh, stranger danger cleaning your room uh sharing with the needy different stuff like that not just a bunch of crap but anyway that was a random video whatever somebody asked me to do it so i did it Just stick with 